back. Go, charm. That's better. Come. Back. Go. Arm twist. Look. Yep. Whoosh. Got to keep back. Got to get your head back. And but but most of you look like this. You like this. You cannot move your feet and legs like this. You're back there. You're back there. And this swings. And then you need to go into that. Your shoulder is back there. Okay? And yum. Yeah? Yum. Pum. Pum. See, every time the toe is going farther and farther, you're reaching. You have to be reaching. Yeah. From this place to that place. Every foot is in a different place. Your arabis needs to be this way. You know, it's not like this. It's that way. Okay? And back, back, twist, and hip, go, hip, your head, your head, your head's on the right, back, that's it, go, and toe, 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 whoosh. Right. Shannon, come, come, come. You've just reinstated yourself. We forgive you for being late. Watch what she's doing. Yeah. E. See the toe? Now you watch what she does here. E. You see? So the most important that you have to work at is that the reason to do the step on layer is so that this foot is far in front of your body because that is going to make you jump when we actually jump. That's the most, again, every step has a preparation. The same with the pirouette. You have to do this to do that, okay? So now when you're going to jump, and if you're going to make that arc in the air, then the distance of that pushing foot, the jumping foot, from this shoulder determines whether you're going to go up and over or you're going to go splat. 